Once panels are complete and ready for plotting, the normal procedure to export the files to DXF, uh, assuming the plotting software requires a DXF import, is to output the panels with the uh, option to DXF selected. Now here you can see we've uh, chosen the, the layer names and layer colors for, the, for this particular output. So we would select the panels, run the output tool, we're asked for a, uh, a file name, and I've just used this one for this example. I'm overwriting a file, and then if we open that file in CAD, we can see the green, which was our cut layer, cyan and blue. Uh, so this file would then go straight into uh, the plotting software. In some circumstances, you may have already uh, organized all of your panels through nesting, for example, and already uh, assigned all of the layers and don't want to use this export method. We can uh, use the export uh, using a Rhino export. However, um, some experimentation may be required. Um, we select the panels, export selected. Now the settings which we uh, understand have the best results are we select DXF. In the options, we select 2007 polylines, then edit the scheme, and for the curves, we make sure that the AutoCAD objects are all polylines. Um, save this, uh, in this case it's already saved, and then click OK. Um, give this a name. And that will export the files um, and be compatible with most uh, plotting requirements.